What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I figure I'll change gears a little bit. Um, obviously, if you've been following along on my channel, I've been doing a lot of um, job site videos lately because I've been doing a lot of painting. So the jobs have just been coming one after the other. So I figured today what I'm going to do is switch gears a little bit. And what we're going to do is we're going to review this new work platform. This is only sold exclusively at Lowe's. Lowe's did send me this, so they're the ones that are sponsoring this video today. So since this work platform is sold exclusively at Lowe's, what I'll do is I'll drop an affiliate link in the description down below. It'll take you directly to their website. I will get a small commission for every sale, but it's at no extra cost to you. So this platform is a little on the heavier side, but it has a 300 pound capacity and it is definitely a heavy duty and is sturdy. With some of them, um, I have another one that's, uh, you know, like one of those Black Friday specials. I think it was, you know, maybe 30 bucks or something like that. And those just are not built as well as this one. You know, the one that I have that was a Black Friday special, I think, was, um, you know, it has like these little hinges that clip in. And then when you're on the platform, it wants to move back and forth like this. It's not sturdy. And if you're looking for something more heavy duty, this is definitely the go-to. So what I'll do is I'll go over the specs and then we'll go over how it operates and um, some of the features that it has on it. All right, guys, let's get into it. But don't forget, keep giving me those thumbs up, keep hitting that bell, keep sharing these videos, and don't forget, subscribe to my channel if you're a new viewer. All right, there it is all folded up. Um, I will say with the other ones that you see in stores, the footprint usually stops in line with this. Obviously these stick out a little further so it's a little harder for me building it in my van But that's because of the wider footprint makes it a lot more sturdy Okay, there's the there's the specs 300 pound capacity 46 inch length 14 inch width and your highest standing level is 30 inches So just a, um, a couple of things off the bat before we get into it You see this? Hopefully you can see that that's bent that was my fault. I was slipped off of this and then my foot came down on here and bent that. But it says right there, this is not a step. The only other thing on this ladder is right here, there's a dent there. And that, I did not do. That came in the box that way. Okay, so here's how you operate each side. There's two clasps on here. You push them in. That opens up the part of, this part of the ladder. Then once you get it folded out like this, on this side, there's another button right here. You push this in, this extends the arms in and out, okay? Another thing with this ladder is the handle. So you guys can see it's in the middle and it's just awkward. I don't like the where the handle is. You know, when you're carrying something, you want it as close to your body. You can see as I'm standing here like this, I can feel my shoulder straining already and my body's kind of leaning this way because of the way I'm holding it. Flip it over like this, this is how I carry it places, like a suitcase. So one thing they could have done is designed a handle for this side here and not in the middle. It's a little awkward to get used to just because it's heavier than some of the other platforms out there, but once you get used to it, it's not a big deal. So there it is all set up. Now the cool feature about this platform is both sides are adjustable. So let's say you got to operate on the stairs. It's really awesome because you can take these and adjust them like this. And there you go. So let's say you're on the stairs. One side can be higher, one side can be lower. Just folding this side all the way. And then if you need to, they actually had this, I saw in a couple of pictures, resting like on a concrete stoop and then this part being on the ground. And here, when I'm up here walking on it, you know, it's not rickety at all. It's nice and sturdy. Another feature, two of these, is actually you can take one end of this and then fold it up and connect multiple platforms together. Uh, you know, I don't know if I would ever do that or not because, you know, having four or five of these, be like hauling these around would be kind of tough unless you had a big trailer. But, you know, for what I'm doing, this works out pretty good for me. So here's this platform that I've had forever and here's how this one folds up with these little clasp pinches on there. And like I said, it works okay, but it's not very sturdy. And then just to show you guys, here's the comparison between the two. So a little bit longer, but it has a wider platform. And then when you look at this one, with the way the hinges are like I talked about, this thing is not nearly as sturdy. See those legs doing that? So it's, it's helped my weight, it's been fine, but 
it's definitely not a, a pro grade or a contractor grade tool. You know, I don't recommend this if you're gonna be having multiple guys on the job site using that. See that? Also, you can't adjust the legs on this one. So it's an okay for just light use, but you wanna get something heavy duty, you gotta go with one of those. All right, guys, so there you go. There's the uh, Warner Adjustable Pro Platform. Like I said, uh, only sold at Lowe's, it's 139 bucks. Don't forget, I'll drop a link down in the description below. It'll take you right to the website to purchase it.